welcome to my channel uh today i wanted to do a video showing an explanation of how i did this drawing right here it's not going to be a detailed explanation um of the steps i take it's just going to be like just going to be showing the key things that i did throughout the drawing um but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and let's get to it so here's a sketch of the drawing that we're gonna do um well it's not a sketch it's more of a line art but you get the point here i am um selecting the area that i'll be coloring i usually don't do this part i just color manually i feel like it's a lot more enjoyable when i do that but i feel like um it looks weird on the time lapse video so i just selected the area plus we'll speed things up so yeah i know it's a weird thing to point out starting with the skin um there's not really a specific reason why I start with the skin. I just kind of prefer to start with the skin. I lay down the flat color for the skin, which is this color. Um, and after I do that, I add on a yellow uh, color at the top, like I'm doing here, and a bluish color around the chin area. And I also add a bit of red to the cheeks um, around the middle uh, where the blue and yellow meet. Now I do the shading, which I use this purplish grayish color and I put my layer on hard light um, to achieve the shadow. And I usually play around with the opacity of my brush to achieve more softer shadows or more harsh shadows. the color of my liner and I'm using a warm dark brown and I'm changing the layer mode uh, to darken to achieve a kind of soft line art color I usually do that step before I do the skin um, right after I'm done with the line art but um, I guess I forgot
some texture to my piece using the carbon stick um, brush on Procade. It's a default brush and um, I'm using a gray color and putting that on overlay mode and to achieve a texture look to the piece. Um, I usually find that texture adds a little bit of something something to the piece and I usually like how it turns out at the end. For the shading of the hair, I basically do the same exact steps as I do for the face. Uh, I basically use that same purplish color with that same um, layer mode. Here I'm adding highlights with um, a soft light layer mode and I'm using this light purple, not light purple, um, I cannot, I don't know my colors, um, light yellow color. <laughs> I didn't really like the color that I originally had for the hair so I changed it up with the hue, saturation and brightness. 
um, setting in Procreate. For clothes, I also do the same thing. There's not really much different as you can kind of see. So for the finishing touches, I select the subject that I'm drawing and uh, fill it in with my shadow color, in this case this purplish color that I've been mashing the whole video, um, and erase some of the parts that I want to be bright, usually around the face, um, I do it a lot around the eyes, and just parts that I feel like should be bright. And then I add a new layer right on top of that shadow layer that I was talking about and make that layer um, into add mode and use that highlight color that I've been using the whole piece and put it in some areas that I want to be um, bright usually around the areas that I erased with the uh, multiply layer that I used. Now we're on 
on to the usually last part that I do on my pieces, um, which is the background. Uh, and for the background, I usually keep it simple, usually just a flat color with just a little area for the color, not the color, the subject to pop out and everything. Um, but today I did this just like Gaussian blur color thing. I don't know how to explain it, but I just use colors that stand out um, and are in the piece. So here's how she turned out, um, she turned out pretty cute, um, I don't know what you think, I hope you like her, um, yeah. <laughs> If you got this far to the video, I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Uh, and if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and do all that stuff. You know, YouTube likes. Um, and again, thank you so much. Have a good day and bye.